Hey, I'm Jay from the Cub Scouts. Welcome back to another episode of Phoenix Wright Ace Attorney. We are currently on the Samurai case where one actor apparently killed another actor. We're trying to defend a guy who says he didn't do it. We thought it was going to be the lady named Old Bag, but she said other people are involved. We're about to check out who they are right now. If you guys are cool with that and you're down with that, everybody get ready and buckle up because here we go. October 18th, Wright & Co. Law Offices. Whew, what a day. This is no time for relaxing, Nick. Say, you think WP's got a chance? I guess that really depends on the people we found out about in today's trial. The director and producer? Yeah, them. Well, what are we doing here then? Let's get to the studios. I agree, let's get out of here. Why are we even here? Studio main gate, we got a skirt skirt. October 18, 2.16 p.m., Global Studios main gate. No one's here. Right, now that they have Miss Oldbag in custody, I still can't believe her name's Oldbag. That's crazy to me. I guess they don't have anyone else to replace her. But now that I think about it, the first guy's name was Saw It. Like, he saw it? I'm so dumb, guys. I can't even be a lawyer because I'm so dumb. I can't even connect the clues. Now, hey, in the guard station, look, she left her donuts. What? I wasn't going to eat them. I'll eat them. Shoot. Give me those donuts. I'm hungry. The computer that runs the studio security cameras. Huh? It looks like it's turned off for the day. Is that significant? The main entrance to the studios. They probably have a police officer on patrol out there. Why the heck do these birds keep chirping? Shut up! I'm trying to commentate! Alright, let's move. Let's go to employee area. Is this where I go, actually? I think so. Look! It's that assistant girl! Hey! Hi, WP's lawyers, right? I heard about the trial. Great job, guys. Oh, 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 don't mention it. Is it true they caught the security lady? Oh, 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 oh. Actually, she just called me. She told me to cover up that drain. You mean that one? Oh, that's a pretty shitty job. Wow, what a mess. I, I know. I'm not so good with handiwork. Some assistant, right? Yeah, but you do work on the props and the backdrops, right? Right. Just lots of times they end up looking worse than they did before I fixed them. Oh? Oh, well, I'm sure these things happen. Nothing to worry yourself about. You're right. I won't. Personally, I think she should worry at least a little bit more. Um, if you'll excuse me, I have to go to the guard station. I'm supposed to fill in for Miss Oldbag. Right. See you later, then. Good luck with your investigation. Something seems sus about her. I don't know what it is. I don't know. Like, I wasn't suspecting her at all because my eyes were locked in on Old Bag. But for some reason, I don't know, that four-eyed freak. Something about the size of her glasses. I think she did something. She did something. Okay, let's check out this shitty job. So, the fanboy they were talking about in the trial today. He came in through that drain? So it seems. I guess they covered it up in a hurry. Hey, hey, Nick. If that drain's covered, the boy won't be able to get in. Uh, yeah, I think that was the idea. I feel kind of sorry for him, though. Don't you? What, you want to rip the grate off? Really, Nick? We can? Whoa, she's serious? Uh-oh. Rip it open or leave it be? Wait, 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 wait. If we rip it open, somebody might come in and kill again! I don't know. But there's an option to rip it open, so maybe we should, right? I don't know, guys. Let me know what you would do, but I think we're gonna rip that bad boy open. Well, I guess some things are just made to be broken. Yay! You know, Nick, you're pretty swell sometimes. Sometimes? Hiya! There. That should make the kids happy. The things we do. <laughs> the killer's gonna come there. We're the accomplice to murder, guys. The drain grate is off. And I know who did it. Now the kids will be able to come in again. Doesn't it make you feel great to do a good deed like that? Must be nice to live so free of guilt. Okay, let's slide to the right. Let's go back in here. The door to the dressing room. It's not locked. Hey, Nick, let's go in. Maybe there'll be something else to steal? Hey, we're not thieves. But we did take that card key. We borrowed that. There's a difference. All right, let's go inside. Let's get out of here. Go move into the dressing room. Okay, um, I don't think that we got anything else besides this doll head. There's an array of cosmetics here. 
According to Maya, that wig was used in some old TV show. Samurai Boogie Woogie, Nick! Get with the picture! Look, explain to me how you can identify a show- Oh, we've seen that. We've seen that. We know what that is. We know what's up. We've been here before. Alright, let's get out of here. Let's move, guys. We're gonna go to, uh, main gate. And what the heck? Oh, hello! Oh, oh! You look a little out of place! It's the clothes, isn't it? I thought my camel vest might do the trick. Kind of an alternative guard fashion thing. Let's talk to you. Why do you seem so sus? So, how are the studios doing? There's police wandering around everywhere. It's terrible. They won't even let me clean up. Don't want me disturbing evidence. I haven't even cleaned up our lunch plates from the day of the murder. You mean those plates with the steak bones left over on them in the employee area? Yeah, can you believe it? I can believe it because it is a crime scene. You're not supposed to touch anything. I'm not even police and I know that. Do kids sneak in here a lot? Well, I don't think that there's many of them, but I do see one in particular a bunch. He's always gawking at the sets or snapping pictures. You should see old windbag's eyes flash when she sees him. She has a bit of trouble catching him though, the director. I heard something at the trial today. They said that the director and producer were here the day of the murder. Oh, sorry. I was in the prop storage room, so I didn't see them. I guess they were here though. The studio head seemed pretty eager to keep us quiet. So they were trying to protect the director? More the producer, really. The producer's our real star here. She saved these studios from the brink of disaster and kept them running. I don't think we'd still be in business if it weren't for that producer. The producer, huh? Okay, did not know that the producer was a she, not that it makes any difference. Let's move. Let's go outside Studio One. Okay, we know it's October 18. Hey, Nick. It looks like Detective Gumshoe isn't here today. You're right. He's probably up to his neck in paperwork after the commotion at today's trial. So, Nick? Remember that Studio 2 we heard about at the trial today? It was down that path with the fallen tree, right? Yeah, I think that's what they said. Maybe the director and the rest of them are there today? Now's our chance, Nick. Let's check it out. So, is his name Phoenix Wright or Nick? I have no clue. But we're gonna go inside Studio... No, outside Studio 2. We never been there. But now we here. This place is deserted. Eh! Nick! What was that noise? It sounded like it came from inside the trailer. Someone must be inside. Hello? No answer. Pretty suspicious if you ask me, Nick. Let's go in. Why don't you use your psychic powers? I don't know. See through walls. I'm not sure we should be banging in. Huh? It's locked. What? Don't we have a key? No, but there's probably one in the guard station at the main gate. Then what are we waiting for? Let's borrow it. If they'll let us. Aw, oh, man. We can't go in. All right. By the time we go back, nobody's going to be there. So we're wasting time. All right. Go to the main gate. Four-eyed freak still here. Let's talk to her. No? Nothing? Can we uh, examine? I gotta get the key, man. The security guard station. I can see the computer that runs the security cameras. Oh, please don't touch anything in there. The security lady would knock the stuffing out of me if she knew. I really want the key to that trailer. Maybe next time. Wait, no, dude. I gotta talk to her. I gotta put on the charm. I gotta put on the moves. I gotta slick the eyebrows and I gotta just like turn on the charm. But there's nothing else that I could say. What the heck is this? Oh my god, I just went into the dressing room and some random guy came here. Huh? We... Wait, you first, who are you? You look pretty suspicious to me. Whatever. 14 MVRS? How can you not know the great Salmonella? I make the late shows. The Steel Samurai mine. RTFC, read the film credits. Really? You're the Salmonella? I'm so sorry. I just... You look so sorry. No, no. Quite all right, really. It's fine, Rob. What is it? You know, unclose our inspection. Hmm. Yeah. Hot, hot, hot. Hey, do you do a lot of cosplay? Because that costume rocks. 
Rock stars? What? Hey, you're drooling! Huh? Buffer home run! You triggered my creative powers! Yes, yes, it's coming to me! Pink Princess! Oh my god, who the hell is this guy? The sequel to the Steel Samurai! Pink Princess Warrior of Little Old Tokyo! Pink Princess? What in the goodness? She's 17! Keep that in mind! FBI open up! The Pink Princess? Why is it gonna be Little Old Tokyo? Why can't I have a cool name like Neo Old Tokyo? Maya, we really need to talk about cool. Okay, I just walked into the dressing room and I swear to Buddha, this random ass dude just popped up and that's what happened. That's my story and I'm sticking to it. Did you notice anything unusual on the day of the murder? Oh, I know who two dudes are. The security lady told you about us, eh? That's right. It was a pretty regular day. We had a run through for an action scene in the morning. Then I made it from lunchtime in the studio to trailer. Heh, <laughs> I was so busy I didn't even get a chance to eat lunch. A T-bone steak, was it? Yeah, suck sauce. I hate missing out on food. Nick, what does suck sores mean? Definitely something that you don't want to be doing to this guy. No idea. Anyway, I was in a meeting from noon till after four. With the producer and some bigwigs from the network. Mr. Hammer's time of death was estimated at 2.30pm. If he's telling the truth, that meeting gives him an alibi. The producer or the bigwigs. Let's talk about the producer. About the producer who was at the meeting with you. Oh, you mean D. Vasquez? She's a genius. Mad skills all the way. Scary though. <sighs> she brought these studios back from the brink of destruction. She's the one who made it possible for me to make the Steel Samurai. You had a meeting with her on the day of the murder, right? Yeah, we were together from noon to 4 p.m. the whole time. Okay, what about the big wigs? The wigs with the bigs. Who exactly are these big wigs people keep mentioning? Oh, the boss over at the network and some sponsors and also a few production guys. They piled into a limousine and got here right around noon. Major tension. Were all of them with you the entire time? Yeah, unfortunately. They're all gray-haired geezers. Hmm, sounds like they'd all be reliable witnesses. Okay, what else can we do here? Like, I, I need to talk to this guy. I need something. What about this spear? Do you know anything about this spear? I try not to pay much attention to things that don't interest me. Lol. Why are you staring at me like that? And why is he licking his lips like... Creeping me out, man. I think he wants to lick my asshole. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Present this. This is WP, right? How do you know? Well, look, he's obviously dragging his foot. Oh, right. The director would know about the injury. He was there. Okay, um, what else can I do, dude? I can't do anything else, right? Clicked on virtually everything. So I guess I got to get out of here. Do we move back to employee area? That was so weird. Okay, go back to studio main gate. What the? Aha! Uh -huh. You again? <laughs> How rude. Acting like you've seen a ghost. You certainly got back to your post quickly. Oh, the police took me away, they did. They pulled out a spare steel samurai costume. Told me to put it on. Can you imagine? How could I, a sweet little old lady, wear a giant suit like that? Mr. Powers is pretty tall. As soon as they saw there was no way I could wear it, they let me go. I guess that would rule out her being the murderer. Anyway, know this, whippersnapper. This old lady never forgets a slight old insult. And you won't get any information out of me. My lips are sealed. You sure are talking a lot for someone with sealed lips. Starting now. One, two, three. <sighs> this lady's too much. She is. Oh, I can still talk to her? Um, about that kid you said you saw. If I see him again, I'm taking him down! Nick, look at her eyes. She's serious. She is. About the director, the one who was on here the day of the murder. If I see him again, I'm taking him down! Nick, I think she's losing it. Okay, uh, we gotta get back into the studio. So, how is we gonna do that? 
The security guard station. I can see the computer that runs the security cameras. Hey! No touching! Guess I'd better investigate there later. Oh, what? Now there's another kid here. I don't understand what's going on. I keep going back to the same spot and then new people pop up. Hey! Hey, wait! I'll bet he came in right through that drain. Hey, um, kiddo! What's your name, sport? I'm not a kid, so don't talk to me like that! Uh-huh, but you... you are a kid! What a rude little brat. That's no way to talk to an adult. I don't see no adults here, hippie fashion chick! A hippie fashion? Nick, I think I'm being mocked. You gotta hand it to Maya. She's pretty sharp and pretty mad. I'm Cody. Cody Hackins. Call me kiddo again and I'll cut you down where you stand, evildoer. Okay, Cody. First of all, where the hell did you get that samurai sword? And two, where can I get one for myself? The Steel Samurai. So you're a fan of the Steel Samurai? How dare you utter that name, evildoer. What do you mean? We're on the Steel Samurai side. Ha-ha! Ha-ha! You can't fool me! Okay, then what's the last line said by the innkeeper in episode 8? Ha! Easy. Like fries with that? Hmm, <laughs> not bad, kiddo. Watch it! What are they doing? Yeah, they're doing a little bit of... I don't know what that means. What happened? Say, you heard anything about the incident the other day? You were here, weren't you? Yeah, he had his camera! Maybe we can see some photos! Did you see anything? He... 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 Always... The Steel Samurai always wins! Always! Yeah, I saw him. I saw everything. What? But no way am I telling you, losers! Damn, this dude is not snitching. He is part of the not snitching code. What? Wait! Let me go! Did we tackle him? I think I punched him in the face. He's gone. Huh? Something fell off the table when he bumped into it on his way out. A bottle? Why was this sitting there, I wonder? Empty bottle slipped into pocket. Found on table in the employee area. The label reads sleeping pills. Oh! Somebody drugged him and then pretend to be him and then killed the steel samurai guy. Oh my god, guys. I'm a lawyer. I'm a Japanese lawyer. I'm doing it, guys. I'm doing it big. Anyway, what was that kid saying? He saw everything. He did, didn't he? Can we follow him? The drain where the fanboy came in. He didn't waste any time coming in either. Talk about cause and effect. Well, I'm glad I opened the drain or else I never would have seen that kid. Is that thirsty ass dude still in here? I wonder if he is. Hold on, let's see. That dude had his tongue out and everything. It's creepy, man. He looked like he was eating butt cheeks. Oh, he still is here. Okay, we can't talk to him. So let's get out of here. Maybe something else will happen. Every time I go somewhere, somebody pops up. So let's go to main gate. Huh? Where's that old windbag? I ought to have heard a lever post. Uh, hey! Nick, that was her. Stop! Whippersnapper! Yeah, sounds like she's chasing after that boy. Uh-oh, she tripped. Maya sure looks happy. I'd be happy too. Old bag. She probably fell on her saggy ass tits. Hey, Nick. Now's our chance. Let's check out the guard station. Good idea. Oh, this is it, Nick. The trailer key. The key to the trailer in Studio 2. Let's get it, boys! All right, finally. Damn, I had to trigger so many events. No wonder. No wonder I couldn't get that stupid key. Okay, go outside Studio 1. Then go outside Studio 2. And then bada bing bada boom. Uh, no, no, no. We actually have to examine and then unlock it. I wonder if the key we borrowed from the guard station will work. Of course it will. Come on now. It opened. Great. Let's go, Nick. She seems eager all of a sudden. Well, you first, Nick. Uh, not that eager. Okay. Let's go inside. She always seems eager. October 18, Studio 2, trailer. Who in the... Damn, baby, what's the... Eh, someone's in here. Names. Uh, our names? Um, we're WP's lawyers, and, um... I see. And who might you? 
D. Vasquez, the producer. D. Vasquez, she's quite beautiful. <laughs> okay, let's talk to D. Vasquez. The day of the crime. I was wondering if you could tell me about the day of the murder. Miss Vasquez? Script. Excuse me? Script. I'm looking for a script. A script? The Steel Samurai, episode 13. I need it. Um, could we ask you a bit about the day of the murder? I need to read it. We're getting nowhere fast. This is mad awkward right now, guys. Um, we'd really like to ask you about the Steel Samurai. Miss Vasquez? It's on TV every week. That's all I have to say about that. Nick! She's telling us to go watch TV? The nerve of her! Hey, don't get mad at me. Okay, what about the director? About the director, Sal Manella, was it? What uh, exactly is his role here? Perhaps I didn't make myself clear? I'm looking for a script. I can't be bothered with anything else. Nick? Are all people in the entertainment business this weird? It's starting to look like it. Nick, let's get out of here. Isn't there someplace else we have to check? Yeah. Wait. Yes? If you see Manella, give him this. Why do we have to do your errands? Um... I... I don't think I like her. Don't cry. She'll take it as a sign of weakness. All right. We'll give it to him if we see him. Vasquez's memo added to the court record. The memo reads, Bring me the script for episode 13. That's a lot of words for just that little amount of writing in there. I don't believe that. Okay, Miss Vasquez. I guess we are going to get our asses out of here, huh? So let's go outside. And he was in the trailer. Oh, no, not this trailer. Damn it. Okay, let me move. Outside studio two. Uh, okay, this is all confusing now. Move here. Move to the main gate. And there we go. Got it. Okay. Inside the trailer. Dressing room. Present you with this, my good man. Here. I got this from the producer. Huh? Bring me the script for episode 13? Episode 13? Where did I put that one? I must have left it somewhere. Uh-oh. Oh, my ass is pwned if I don't find it! Nick, it might be quicker to just look in all the places where he's likely to have been. I agree. Okay, I know where he's been. I know exactly where it is, because I was just there. It was inside of uh, Studio One. Watch, guys. If I'm wrong, I'm going to slap my ass. I'm going to slap my pale ass inside Studio One. And it's going to be right here in this chair. Hey, look! That's the chair the director sits in. I've always wanted to sit in one of these. The director! Maya, take a look around the chair for me, would you? Remember that script the director was talking about? Didn't he say he'd left it somewhere? Aha! Uh -huh. Found it, Nick! The script! Yes, see? I don't have to spank my pale white ass! Good work. Script placed in pocket. A Steel Samurai script, the cover reads, episode 13. Why is this so dirty? Is that Avidance? Maybe we should keep it for ourselves. Well, we gotta go back to Miss Vasquez. Not just because, you know, she's looking pretty fun. Even though she is, you know what I'm saying, guys? Okay, go to trailer. And let's present you with da -da -da -da, this. Here, we found it. Your script. Ah. Script handed to D. Vasquez. Um, uh. You're not gonna talk to us? Quiet. I'm reading. Just you hold on. What's the big idea? Who do you think you are anyway? And do you even know who we are? Powers Lawyers. Um, right. Am I a suspect? No, it's just, well, no, but... You wanted to know about the day of the murder? Yes. Yes. Anything you could tell us would be a big help. You know there was a meeting here at noon? Yes, with the director and the people from the network. Correct. Now, listen closely. None of the people in this trailer that afternoon went to Studio One. It was impossible for us to leave. Impossible? Why? The path was blocked. The 
path? On the day of the murder, the path that leads here was blocked? You saw Mr. Monkey on the way here, correct? Mr. Monkey? The monkey with the broken head. Oh, right, that. What an original name. Its head fell over in the wind on the day of the murder. They didn't start moving the head out of the way until after three. It was after four by the time the path was unblocked. Capiche? Everyone in this trailer was stuck here until the path was cleared. Why don't you just go on the freaking grass? Are you guys too bougie to walk on some grass? Anyone, especially the killer, could just leave that trailer, walk on the grass, stabby stabby, and then go back in the trailer like nothing happened. That would be the perfect alibi. But apparently nobody can go on this path because nobody wants to go walk on some leaves. Stuck in this trailer. Stuck until after 4. Hammer died at 2.30. Thus, none of us could have gone to Studio 1. What? It's true. A crane came just after 3 to move the head. We called some people in to clear the way. I'm sure they'd corroborate my story. But, but, but wait! What if the head fell over after 2.30? Then you could have gone to Studio 1. 2.30. The time of death. Very well. Come. That's Mr. Monkey. When it wasn't broken, it announced the time. In ooks. One ook per hour. Oop, 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 oop. Always with the ooking. It is a monkey after all. Check its head. The clock inside stopped when it broke. Nick, it stopped at 2.15. 2.15? That's right. This path was blocked from 2.15 until after 4. Therefore, we're innocent. Mr. Hammer died in Studio 1 at 2.30. See? Goodbye. Mr. Monkey's head data added to the court record. Block the path to the scene of the crime between 2.15 p.m. and 4 p.m. What do we do, Nick? There isn't anyone besides WP who could have killed Hammer. It's over. We're finished. It sure doesn't look good. Guess we should head back to the office and plan our strategy. Wait, what about that kid? He had a camera! What if he saw everything? Well, he said he saw everything, right? So, what do we do? Hold on. Is he anywhere here? Did they find him? Like, hold on, hold on. They must have found him. Old Bag tackled him. Old Bag tackled this bitch ass! Okay, I guess not. We gotta go back. I don't think that there's anything left for us to do. So, we're gonna go back to Wright & Co. And we just gotta figure out something. October 18, Wright & Co. Law Offices. Now what? We're fresh out of clues. Everyone's alibi is watertight. We don't even have any promising leads. Things are looking pretty grim. It's a little early for giving up, don't you think? Huh? You've got one lead. M Mia, it's you! What took you so long? Sorry, Phoenix. Maya has trouble calling me unless she's really in trouble. Right. Oh, wait. I guess that means we're really in trouble. I'd say so. What did you mean we have one lead? The boy, of course. Yeah, the little snot-nosed kids. Yeah, I saw him. I saw everything. What? But no way am I telling you, losers. I don't know. He didn't sound like he was going to help us at all. I'm sure you can find some way of bringing him over to your side. Either way, we should go back to the studios. That boy is our last hope, Phoenix. Thanks, now I'm more worried than I was before. Okay, thank you, Mia, with your ghostly big tatas. We're gonna go back to Studio Main Gate, and Old Bag is here! Come on. Oh, what the heck? My bad. Come on, lady, stop huffing and puffing, please. What's wrong? Whippersnapper! She's been chasing that boy this whole time. Look, when, when I ca catch him, I... Sounds like she hasn't had any luck catching him. Oh, I caught a hostage now. Whippersnapper! A hostage? A hostage. Give me the hostage. Give me the hostage, baby! What's this about a hostage? When that boy was running away, he dropped his hand. Ren, he'll come back. It's kind of hard to understand her with all that huffing and puffing. Phoenix, that hostage might be what we need. Cody might talk to us if we give him that. Good idea. Miss Old Bag, might I? No! I'm catching that brat if it's the last thing I do. 
Phoenix, do you have anything you might trade with her? A trade? Hmm. I wonder. What? Trade what? Mia, do we give you not monkey head? Nah, I can't give you monkey head. I'll give you the card key. Hey, that's... That's a card. Studio One? Right, a card key to Studio One. I... I could visit poor Hammer. I'd like to visit... He died. I was his... His fan. You don't have your own card, Miss Old Bag? Studio One is in my turf. You'll let me borrow... Borrow it then. If I give her the card key, then I won't be able to get into Studio One. Keep the card key, lend her the card key. Why don't you let her borrow it, Phoenix? I guess it can't hurt. Here you go, Miss Old Bag. Card key lent to Miss Old Bag. Listen to me, Sonny. I don't like having debts to no whippersnappers. You take this, and we're even, deal? What's this? A Steel Samurai trading card? That sneaky kid dropped it! I figured it's pretty important to him, though. Thank you, I may have a use for this. This must be the hostage she was talking about. Steel Samurai card added to the court record. Right, I'm off. There she goes, hobbling off toward the studio. Thanks for telling me that she was hobbling off. Okay, let's go back to employee area. He might be there. October 18, Global Studios employee area. There you are. Hey! Hey, you! Wait a sec! Phoenix, was that the boy? Yeah, his name is Cody Hackins. I think he ran into the dressing room. Okay, well, I'm gonna go in there. October 18, Global Studios dressing room. He's sure to be in here somewhere. Found you! Damn it! He's getting away! Come back! There, he's back. How did she... Hey there, would you mind helping us out? Please? I'm Cody. Uh, hello, Cody. I'm Mia, Mia Faye. Nice to meet you. Yo! And I'm Phoenix Wright. Who asked? Phoenix, you can take it from here. I'm not so sure I'm qualified. Okay, kid. Don't make this hard for me. The Steel Samurai is so cool. I think he's, um, the bomb. Ha! <laughs> well, what a lamer like you know about the Steel Samurai. Hey, watch that attitude. Phoenix, you really shouldn't yell like that. He's only a kid. Nah, he a little bitch. Yeah, don't yell like that. I'm only a kid. You're a little dick. So, do you know anything about what happened here? Could you tell me, please? I don't know nothing. Hmm, looks like a little persuasion's necessary. Maybe a bribe? Yes, I got your bribe right over here. It's like crack cocaine. Present you with the cards. Cody, this look familiar? Hey! You're, uh, what? You are, you know, ultra rare. That's cards really hard to get. Man, for a grown-up, you sure are dumb. I'll give you this, if you help me. But that's my card! For offering me something I already own. You're in effect. Skewing the very basis of our consumer society, namely the principle of fair trade. Man, for a grown up, you sure are dumb. What do they teach these kids in school these days? Quantum physics? Whatever, I don't need that card. Huh? I got a double. Just keep it. It's yours. What? After I went through all that trouble? If you want to trade, buy me a really rare card. Really rare? You mean there's something rarer than ultra rare? Ultra rare premium cards are way rarer than plain ultra rare cards. Come on! Man, bro, you shut up! You shut your mouth before I slice you with your own samurai sword! Premium rare? Why do I feel like we're talking about steaks? Okay, premium rare? You want this head? What's that? Boring! Man, how come one person be so lame? If you are a superhero, you'd be lame, oh man! Okay, what about this? Hey, it's the Steel Samurai! Huh? Why is he dragging his foot like that? Where'd you get this anyway? Uh, okay, what about the spear? The Samurai Spear! That's totally cool! I wish I had one too! This kid and Maya would get along great. 
Okay, um, I guess I gotta find like an ultra rare card? Hold up, kid. I don't got time for that, man. I don't got time for all that bull, kid! Alright, I'm out of here. I guess I gotta find the ultra rare card. You gotta be dicking me, dude. Outside Studio 1. Let's go outside Studio 2. Move over here a little bit. Trailer. Okay, this is where we're supposed to go. Oh, hi! Hello. What brings you here? Oh, well, I had to arrange some stuff. Um, yes? The, um, girl with you, doesn't she seem a little different? Like, is she even the same person as before? Um, nope, she's the same as always. Same as always. Okay, whatever you say. The fanboy. Have you seen that boy since then? Nope. You missed it, though. The security lady was chasing around after the boy so fast, I thought she'd collapse. Of course, she got away in the end. Boy, was she mad. Actually, we saw them. How's the old windbag doing? She was squeezing donuts through her clenched fist back at the guard station. Some people take their jobs a little too seriously. Okay, how do I get an ultra-rare card, man? Come on! Are all the posters on the wall here of Hammer? Yes. It's really a terrible loss for the studios. But his popularity had been waning recently, right? That's true. Then again, after what happened... After what happened? You mean you don't know about Hammer? No, what? I'm sorry. I shouldn't have said anything. No, what happened? You tell me right now! Wait, now you have to tell me. What happened with Hammer? I'm sorry. I'm probably not the one who should tell you. Uh-oh. Why do I get the feeling something's being covered up here? Uh, who in the world the heck am I doing? Can I get one of these? Old movie poster. Can I have one of these, please? This is one of Maya's favorite movies. Maybe we should replace the poster in the office with this one? That would be kind of sad. Oh, okay. Can I have one of these? Wait, let me present her with the cards. Do you know anything about this? Hey, that's a Steel Samurai trading card. I collect those, actually. I'm one card away from a complete set. A complete set? Yeah, a set of one of each card. Huh. Wait. Wait, 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 wait. That's it! That's the card I need! You don't know how long I've been looking for it! Uh... I don't care what kind of girl you might think I am. I need that card. Please! I beg you! Please trade with me! Sh trade with you? Yes, trade cards. Look, I'll even trade you an ultra rare premium card. Let's get it, boys! Trade me all, huh? Yes, it's a good deal for your ultra rare. Please! Phoenix, can't you see she's desperate? What's everybody getting so excited about? Trade, of course! I need that ultra rare premium shit! Really? <laughs> Thanks! Then this is for you. URP card added to the court record. Let's go! That's what I'm talking about. Doesn't doing good things like that make you feel great? No. Yeah, yeah, it does. I don't like doing good things, man. I like doing hood things. Let's go back. Let's trade that card. All right, you little punk. We got what you need right over here. See this card? Yeah. So, wait. That's it. That's the last ultra rare premium card I need. Come on, give it to me, please. You got to give it to me. Wow, I never seen him so eager. Right, okay, how about a trade? You're on. I'll give you a samurai spear and throw in an evil magistrate to boot. No, 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 no. Not that kind of trade. I don't want cards. I want information. Huh? You sure? Fine by me. URP card given to Cody. Okay, Phoenix, let's hear what he has to say. If you know something that could help us, we can have him take the stand tomorrow. Okay, what do you know? Tell me everything. You were here on the day of the incident, right? Yeah. Did you see anything unusual? Cody. Cody, he needs to know because he's fighting for justice. Isn't that the Steel Samurai's motto? For great justice? You have to help us fight for great justice too. I... I saw... I saw everything! Well, well, we might get some useful information out of him yet. So, you like the Steel Samurai? He's so cool! I... I guess. 
You're judging him by his looks. You have to look at his actions, at his life. I'm being lectured on life by a grade schooler? You like him too, don't ya? Uh, oh, me? Yeah, I, um, love the Steel Samurai. So tell me what your favorite thing about the Steel Samurai is. His kind nature, his fighting skills, Will Powers acting. His kind nature. Right, come on, think of something. I really like, um, his kind nature. What a guy. Totally. He looks so tough, but inside he's as gentle as a kitten. Yeah. So what else do you like about him? Don't tell me I have to keep this act up. So tell me what your favorite thing about the Steel Samurai is. Uh, Will Powers acting. Well, i never even seen a full episode of that dumb show. Uh, actually, I'm kind of a fan of Will Powers. Well, that's totally hardcore. You're calling me hardcore? So what else do you like about him? Are you serious, dude? Okay, his fighting skills. Shit. Gotta think of something. I like it when he, uh, he vanquishes his foes. Yeah, wazam! Steel Samurai always wins. Always! Check this out. It's my fan album. What the? It's all pictures of the Steel Samurai. I go to every live performance. Those stupid publicity stunts when they beat each other up in public? I always take a picture when the Steel Samurai lands the final blow. Wazam! I got them all. I never missed one. A perfect collection. Check it out. My new digital camera. Wow, that's very impressive. The newest model, isn't it? Wait. If he says he's never missed a fight and he's taken every picture, maybe he has the final blow of when that guy got stabbed in his chest. Right? You bet, lady. I just got it for my birthday. My album has a name. Wanna hear it? The Steel Samurai, Path to Glory. The Steel Samurai always wins. Always. Hey, if you want this, you can have it, lady. Really? Are you sure? Yeah, I took these with a digital camera. I got all the data at home, so I can always make another one. Well, then I'm happy to accept. Thank you. Path to Glory Received. Contains photos of every victory scene in every battle the Steel Samurai has won. What's with people always giving stuff to Mia? What a life. Uh, what you saw. Cody, I need to ask you something very important. What did you see on the day of the incident? I got here that day around two. I had to come in through the woods out back so that old lady wouldn't see me. I got kind of lost, though. I was in there for maybe half an hour or so. Then I finally got to the studio. After that... What is it, Cody? The Steel Samurai killed the bad guy. He used his samurai spear. Just like always. One shot, one kill. It happened so fast, I got scared. I went home after that. I see. It must have been hard for you. Man, you say those nice things, but it's so obvious you aren't speaking from the heart. Um, right. Mia? Yes? I think we can say for sure this means the Steel Samurai did it. True enough. And the director has an alibi, so it wasn't him. Indeed. So the only person left who it could have been is Will Powers. I have to admit, it's kind of a shock. But if you put this boy on the witness stand, your client will be guilty for sure. Let's not call him then. I think that would be wise. Best to leave this one alone. Not so fast, pal. I heard everything. This boy here is a key witness. And he's under police protection starting now. Come on, son. You've got a rendezvous with me down at the precinct. No, I ain't going. Ah! That didn't go so well. We're back to zero leads. And now we have a serious handicap in court. What are we gonna do, Mia? Check the photo album, dude. Well, hmm. I really need to be going. Don't worry, Phoenix. I'm sure you'll be fine. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Come to the trial tomorrow, please. I need you there. Phoenix, can I ask you something? Do you really believe that Mr. Powers is innocent? I think so. I think he is. He seems really scared and innocent. I don't think he did it. Of course he is. That's all I wanted to hear. Excellent. I'll see you in court then. Great. Thanks, Mia. See you soon. To be continued. I think there's something in that photo album that we didn't see yet, but we're about to find it out in the next episode. If you guys want to see the trial as soon as possible, like tomorrow, make sure you leave a like on this video so I know you guys want more. But if you guys enjoyed this video and can't wait for more Phoenix Wright, 
Make sure you give this video one big fat like. And tell a friend today that Jay from the Cub Scouts is that dude.